Hello, 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 and welcome back to the Intuitive Ones channel on TikTok and the Black Queen Prophetess channel on YouTube. Tonight, I am doing a quick nine-card tarot card reading, um, beginning of Libra season reading, okay? And I'm doing it all on TikTok, so I only got nine minutes, so let's go. Holy Spirit, you are welcome in this place. I yield myself to you to receive and convey the message you have for Libra, beginning of the season reading. What do you want to tell them? How this season is going to go, Holy Spirit. How is this season going to be? What do you want to talk to the Libras about, Holy Spirit? I thank you for your message. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Okay, so first card that kind of popped out here is a Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Pentacles, okay? That's not the main subject, but it looks like that you're going to be um, having a, a lot of money here. Coming in, ten is a number of wrapping things up ending of the cycle beginning of new cycles so um 10 is also a number of abundance this is also the um year of jubilee is usually on the 10th celebrated every 10 years so you may be being relieved of debt or relieving someone of debt like two cards just popped out and i was able to reach them so you have the two of coins so you're balancing your books here um and then you have the high priestess okay mm -hmm. so you may need to uh, uh tap into the holy spirit you always need the holy spirit you always need to tap into the holy spirit okay always okay this card kind of popped out you got pinnacles you make your money you're doing money, Libra. Okay, so we got the seven of pentacles. You're making literally money. Okay, so this season, you know, you turning up, but you making money. It's like, turn up, Libra season, let's get this money. Okay, I'm getting to the money. Everybody mad, right? People mad at you, Libra, for making all this money. Okay, this one keeps stabbing me in the hand. So the hangman, <laughs> perfect subject for you okay you always in between you can't make a decision jesus christ but you are tapping in this hangman is someone who's able to um tap into the spirit and uh, and relate to man okay so um again this is again it's another uh uh, uh heavenly sign so the holy spirit that is the center card and he wants to talk to you about uh, um playing the fence stop it okay make a decision this is a 12 card if you can see the roman noodle that's 12 roman noodle 12 which breaks down to a three and this is also increased so you are um i heard the holy spirit is is helping you make a decision you can say the holy spirit told you to do it okay just listen to the holy spirit don't sit up there and try to make a decision yourself leave because you ain't gonna make one not one in time okay so if the holy spirit says go go and if it doesn't don't okay but you're really gonna need to lean in it we don't got time for you to try to sit up here and make a decision there was another card that came out here that flipped over and this is the will of fortune Ooh, child Ooh, child, I'm hearing, listen to the Holy Spirit. Do as the Holy Spirit. You don't try to make a decision. If you are presented with a decision, ask God. Pray about it first, and he'll tell you what to do because he's leading you into a lot of money or material things or whatever you need for success. You are. This is your season, okay? And, and God is really showing out for you, it seems to me. You got the will of fortune? Yes. You tapping into the spirit? Yes. 
you're making decisions asking that's not you that's that's the holy spirit in you helping you make decisions what else do you want to talk to what else how are you going to round out okay um we have the three of swords so you've been heartbroken okay someone has disappointed you someone has backstabbed you this satellites you <laughs> okay i know y'all seen that real they try to d d destroy you okay so there's four cards that came out all i need is two um holy spirit which one okay this one here we have the king of wands someone who is in control of your um moving forward someone that's a boss this may be you i may have to turn all i'm gonna close my door because there's background sounds here um but you're making major moves or you're connected to someone who's helping you make these major moves here oh i'm sorry this i said the king of wands this is the page of wands so yes you yeah you've been backstabbed someone has tried to keep you down yes yes you had someone that tried to keep you down okay don't concentrate on that because you're getting word about um a job that's coming in or um a business deal is going to come in here okay and the outcome card here holy spirit outcome card is money exchange it's like oh it looks like oh you're destitute five is a number of change okay when you're talking about pentacles, that means, yes, you will be spending money. You'll be losing money, but it's an, an, an um, it's exchange, not, um, this looks, oh, they're going, they're going to be destitute. No, 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 no. Someone will. It's not going to be you. It's not going to be you. Um, a five is a change. It is loss, but it's you can see it as loss or you can see it as investment I, i'll see you later so yeah you will have a lot of money you're going to have god is going to tell you to where to invest your money okay and you're oh the holy spirit what i heard so definitively libra is the outcome is it's going to look like you're down like when you invest you're going to invest a lot of money so that, yeah, you won't have the money to go on that trip. No, you won't have the money to do certain things. But your money is working for you. You're going to see it come back to you. So, yes, right now, maybe you won't turn up for your birthday. You're saving money. You got big plans. God got big plans. He wants you to balance your books here, okay, so that you can get this money coming in here. Uh, okay, you're investing in your business, the Holy Spirit. Some of y'all, you are investing in your entrepreneurial um, uh, endeavors, okay? You are investing for your future, whatever it is. But the Holy Spirit is definitely um, guiding you. He's not waiting for you to make a decision because you'll never make it, okay? You're too afraid to make of making a wrong decision, Libra, okay? Just tap into that Holy Spirit. Tap into it. Okay? He's going to tell you what to do. And how to do it. How to balance your books. Okay? Just hear His voice. Okay? You have an unction to do something. or When I say an unction, you have that a feeling that says, Invest in Vong. Or put the money down for this. Do it. Simply. Just do it. Don't try to understand it. Don't try to figure it out. Okay, Libra? That's all I have for you. I hope you have a wonderful season, Libra. And I will see you back here at the end of the season to do your end of season read. All right? You all have a good one. Bye.